How do you enable Instagram and Facebook shopping for your GoDaddy website, verify your domain, upload products to your catalog automatically, and much more? Let me tell you. Hi, I'm Lydia, and on this channel, we talk about social media marketing for business and how to make more money online. If you're interested in these topics, make sure to click the subscribe button below. Now, here are the things you need if you want to enable this feature on your account. The first thing you need is an Instagram account, a professional business one, with a sufficient follower base and demonstrated trustworthiness, so your brand needs to be established on the platform. You will also need daily activity, posting, engaging with your customers on your Instagram account. The next thing you need is a professional Facebook page for your business that as well is very well optimized for your business, represents your brand and has enough followers or likes. Next, you will need your GoDaddy website with a unique domain with a professional website design and listed physical products that people can check out. And then you will also need a Facebook commerce account with a catalog in your Facebook business manager that I will show you how to create in today's video. So when you start the process to enable Instagram and Facebook shopping for your GoDaddy website, the first thing you need to do is go ahead and verify your GoDaddy domain. To do that, first you need to go to business.facebook.com, click on commerce, more tools, business settings, brand safety and domains, and add your domain without the www before the domain name. After you click add, you will see three options to verify your domain. We will use the HTML code verification method in this video to verify the domain. But if you're looking for other ways to verify your domain or to learn how to do that for GoDaddy, in this video I also showed the DNS text record method. So copy the code from Facebook and now let's go and embed it into your GoDaddy website. To do that, go to your GoDaddy website, click on it, click edit website, go to settings, Facebook meta tag, add new code and paste the code you copied from Facebook. You need to paste the code in the header section, then save it. After you add your code, you can go back to Facebook and verify your domain. Sometimes it doesn't happen immediately, it can take a few hours, it can take a few days, and if it takes longer than three days, make sure to watch this video to see what are the errors, or you can contact Facebook support so they can tell you more about this and how you can actually verify your domain. Next, you want to make sure that you have a catalog created for your business and a commerce manager as well. If you don't have one already, you need to go to business settings, data sources and catalogs and click add and then give your catalog a name. By creating a catalog, you will also create a brand new commerce account. But when you do that, make sure that GoDaddy is not connected to your catalog. We will create this manually and add products manually before connecting GoDaddy for automatic product upload. Then you can click open in commerce manager for your catalog and click add items and add manually. You can start adding 10 items manually by adding their title, description, website link, price and photo. Be sure to not add the title or the description of the item all in caps lock or by using a lot of special signs. Once you do that, you need to go to your commerce manager settings and set up the entire commerce account as I show you in this video step by step. You will need to set up shipping and return, make sure that your business assets are connected and much more. When you are sure you have a sufficient follower base on both your Instagram account and Facebook page and that they both demonstrate trustworthiness for your brand, you can go ahead and apply for a shop by going going to shops and click start now. You can click check out on another website, select your catalog, your sales channels, your domain, add your business email, select the regions that you ship to, agree with their commerce policies and then click finish setup and your accounts will be put up for review. If you run into any issues in the products catalog, make sure to review them and fix them using this video right here before you apply for review. Your shop will be put up for review and it can take up to two weeks for you to hear back from them. You can hear back from them either in your Instagram app, either in your commerce manager, the overview section and if you get rejected for any reason, they will tell you what the reason is in your commerce account and if you're looking for a way to appeal a rejected commerce account, this video will help. Now when this feature gets approved, you will get a notification in your Instagram app as well as your email and you will be able to tag products in your posts, stories and reels as well as on your Facebook page. You will have the view shop option both on your Instagram account and on your Facebook page as well and thankfully you will not be needed to add items manually to your catalog because I will show you how to enable automatic product upload to your catalog with a GoDaddy website. To start the process for that, go to your GoDaddy website go to stores and marketplace, click on Facebook and Instagram and connect your Facebook account there. 
select your Facebook page, your Instagram account, and your product should start syncing automatically to your catalog. They can take a little bit before they actually show up in your catalog and that can be from a few hours to a few days. So be patient and make sure that all your products comply with Facebook commerce policy so they will be added to your catalog and not have issues. Once all your products are added to your catalog, what's left for you to do is create beautiful collections using this video right here that will showcase all types of products in your shop as well as singular products and more. That will help you get that personalized look for your brand in your Facebook and Instagram shop. So there you go, this is how you enable and set up Instagram and Facebook shopping for a GoDaddy website. If this video helped you, don't forget to leave it a like and subscribe down below for more such videos every single week. You can follow me on Instagram and on TikTok at lydia.incomingsuccess for more tips on growing online and making more money. Thank you so much for being here and I will see you in my next video.